Over the years, looking at sorghum producers and their management of the crop, trying to produce the best yield possible, I see one common theme as it comes to management practices that are limiting yield potential in sorghum production. Often that is nitrogen fertilization. Sorghum is a crop that needs good nitrogen fertilization. However, historically we've not treated it as a primary crop or a user crop like we would corn. Sorghum, a nice rule of thumb with sorghum is 1.2 pounds of N per bushel. So that's 1.2 pounds of nitrogen per bushel of expected yields. You know, often I look at producers, they're producing, uh, they're putting down a marginal amount of nitrogen or a minimal amount of nitrogen, just hoping for the best and losing out on some great yield potential. As you're getting ready for your nitrogen plans on your sorghum crop, whether it's already in the ground or out there, make sure you have an idea of what you're going to do, whether it's an all upfront pre-plant fertilization plan or minimum up front with a side dress option. We can easily side dress nitrogen and sorghum. In fact, in Oklahoma, we have a common practice of going down rows with UAN dropping streamer nozzles or a drop nozzle and getting that nitrogen in season. We do that here in the Southern Great Plains because of the, the risk of not having enough moisture to get crop through. So a marginal upfront nitrogen and then coming in with a nice side dress once we know we have a good stand and a good yield potential. Again, the key though, is knowing your yield potential for your region. Our sorghum has a great genetic potential of producing more than 250 bushel. You tie that with the right environment, the right moisture, and the right nitrogen, and you get awfully close with your field.